Hey guys, so this is my second night here at the Sivaris Suites, and I'm going to do another bath cocktail tonight. I'm also going to do another one tomorrow, but tonight's bath cocktail is going to be the uh, Popping Pills bath cocktail. And what comes in this is the Happy Pill, which is actually being discontinued. You can actually only get it in your stores with uh, whatever they have left of their product. I know my store only has like a couple more of these. I've stocked up on it. It does smell pretty good. Um, they don't have it online anymore. I did see that, that they're out of stock online. So you do have to go to a store. And next what we have in here is the Pop in the Bath Bubble Bar. Um, I got this one from the Fort Wayne. It's really cute. It's got a very dark pink color to it, unlike mine from my original store. And I'm going to be throwing in a You've Been Mangoed Bath Melt. Can you tell which bath melt is my favorite? I use it all the time. And then I'm going to be using the Sexy Peel Soap. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to use the whole thing of the Happy Pill, but I'm only going to use half of the Pop in the Bath because I didn't bring any other bubble bars, silly me. Um, we actually went to the Fort Wayne store to buy extra products to use in this tub. Um, I didn't want to go through my actual stash, so I got distracted talking about the UK, the new UK bath bombs with the associate, and I just, I totally just lost it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and break this up, and I'll come back real quick and show you what it looks like. One second. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and throw in the happy pill and get that going. Well, we kind of sank a little bit. Okay, I've, been, I've seen videos of this one before, and it does go, it does dissolve pretty quickly. Okay, then I'm going to throw in my, you've been mangoed, get the ring of essential oils going on that one. And I will come back as soon as this is done, and I'll pop in the, uh, pop in the bath and turn on the jets and show you how much bubbles I get. Okay, so the Happy Pill is almost completely done. Still just a little slipper. It actually looks a little bit like Pac-Man. It was turned to the side and it looked like Pac-Man. And then I've got a pretty good, let me turn up the light so you can see, whoop, pretty good ring of essential oils going on there. Let me turn on a little bit more so you guys can actually see this. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and throw it in. I just crumbled it up in this bag because I don't have another bag. Now I'm just going to throw it down in the middle. Make sure I got it all out, which I did. Okay, so it's in there. Next what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and turn on the jets so it's going to get a little bit loud. Bear with me. Let me turn the light a little bit. Get that going. See what kind of bubbles I can get. Okay. What I'm noticing a little bit with the happy pill is if you just let, leave it alone, it kind of forms this ring around the tub with this orange. This should go away. So just make sure you're moving it around. I wasn't really moving it around because I just wanted the bath melt to sit still and just melt and show you the ring of essential oils again. So bubbles are getting pretty good. Remember I only used half of the pop in the bath. So it's not going to be a ton of bubbles. Like last night the bubbles were taking over the tub. So it was a lot. Okay. Um, another thing I want to note I want to note on this video is we got some new candles, these little guys, and we have a big one in the room if I can kind of show it. It's right above the bed. That's my boyfriend. I also have my other Lush bag. I'm above, above the bed. But we've got a two wick, can, uh, two wick um, candle of it, and we got the little pack of the little mini ones to put around everywhere. We did the same thing last year, but we did it with, I believe the scent was Beach Walk. And this year we got the Tahitian, I think it's the Tahitian white flower. Um, if that's wrong, I'll just post it below the video just to let you know what it is. It smells so good. I'm not a huge fan of big floral kind of smells, but I, the second I smelled this one, I was like, oh my god, this is amazing, it's beautiful, it's just, yeah, I settled on that one. Okay, so I'm getting some pretty good bubbles up in here. Up in here. Sorry. I'm just so happy right now. This is the second day of our vacation, and... I am completely relaxed and enjoying my stay. 
We've got tomorrow during the day we're going to go to the zoo in Indianapolis. They have huge dolphins there and they do amazing tricks. So not that there's anything wrong with the Chicago dolphins. I just we like to get away. And let's see what else tomorrow night. We're going to go go-karting and like boat bumper cars and stuff like that. We like to act like children on our vacation. <laughs> don't mind us. Um, and there's something else we were going to do. I don't know. And then on Sunday, sorry, Saturday? Saturday. Sunday. Okay, I think it's, you know, it is Sunday. Sorry. I'm indecisive. So on Sunday, we're going to a preseason game for the Colts against um, the 49ers. Um, I am not a fan of the Colts. I'm sorry. I know if you're a fan of the Colts, I am so sorry. Um, I'm a Bears fan. I'm a Cubs fan as well, so I hope I don't lose any subscribers because of that, but I was born and raised, raised a Cubs fan. I'm going to stick to it. So, But we're going because Steve is a huge sports fan, and he wants to see the stadium. And Yeah, so this has been on for quite a couple minutes now, and we're getting some good bubbles. Of course, I'm not going to get these kind of bubbles at home. I don't have jets at home. That water's hot. Steve is not going to like that. I might have to turn on the water. Cold water. So last night's bath, we were in here for like 45 minutes. And he let me wash his hair with my shampoo. Oh my gosh! I forgot the biggest thing. So I come home today. I'm sorry, I don't come home. We came back here today after we went out for a little bit. Um, we went to see a movie. I know. I work in a movie theater and I'm on vacation and we went to see a movie. Wow. So anyways... We went to see a movie, and we came back, and the room was all cleaned up, like we wanted it to. And they have someone that comes in and uh, checks on the pool. And um, they came in, they cleaned. I didn't notice anything, you know, wrong or anything. The place was beautiful, clean, whatever. Um, and then I went to start getting this bath cocktail ready, and I noticed that my... Um, scenic shampoo wasn't on the side of the tub anymore and I remember trying to remind myself hey don't leave that there because it's not going to be there when you get back back most likely just my luck they threw it away my scenic shampoo is now gone and it, it wasn't like you know a half bar or even less than a half bar it was it was like two weeks old maybe a little less I'm so depressed so Steve said that Monday, Monday's our last day on our vacation. He said we're going to go to Chicago. We're going to go to Lush so I can get my shampoo. Because I don't use, I use my Trichomania, but I don't use it as much as my Scenic. And my Scenic's the only one I brought on this trip. So ugh, I'm kicking myself now. I'm going to have to use, like, hotel shampoo, the little samples. Which is nothing wrong. I'm not really big on, you know, high, pro you know, high profile products to use on my hair. But I just, I love my Scenic shampoo. But, whatever. I got to use it one last time last night, but, okay. Okay, so, this is the amount of bubbles. I'm sorry, I just blabber on. Please, you know, feel free to tell me. Hey, you need to shorten your videos. I'm sorry. Okay, so it's not really a big color. It is a little bit of an orange, but it's barely an orange color because it is such a big tub, and I only used half of the pop in the bath, which would make it kind of a pinkish color, but when you put the pink and the orange together, it makes kind of a light brown, gray, orange, I guess. I don't know how to say that. But there's pretty good bubbles, and when I turn on, when I'm in the bath and I turn on the uh, jets again, the bubbles will go back up. So we're going to go ahead and enjoy this bath. Look for another bath cocktail coming up right after this. Um, tomorrow night, I am doing a um, another UK bath bomb. Um, I'm not going to tell you which one, but you're going to be able to know as soon as you look on my page because I'm going to put all these videos up at the same time. So look out for that. Again, give me any kind of suggestions you want on bath cocktails. I can definitely do it. If you want any, if you want any answers on any questions you have um, on the products, I've used a lot of them. Please just ask, um, and I will try to get back to you if I know the answer, of course. If not, I will definitely try to find out for you, okay? I will see you guys later. Bye.